and uh, he had the better of you last year and first match this year you got the win so what does that uh, kind of do for yourself and how did you prepare for that match going into it um i just prepared for it like anything else you know uh, try to focus on what i do best uh, and focus on some stuff in practice but uh i think it just you know uh proves that you know i am getting better and uh, maybe that was a match I would have lost last year, but it's good to get that one back, especially he beat me in the duel, and then it really hurt at national. So just just getting that back and kind of feeding into the uh, postseason was good for me. Coach John has said that he's seeing progression with you, but he still wants you to kind of open up your offense a little bit more. So what are you kind of doing in the room to, to maybe do that and be a little bit more proactive? <coughs> Um, you know, in practice, I, I, sh I shoot a lot, and I've been focused on it. And I think uh, Coach uh, Caldwell said it best. You know, um, if, if you're going to do something to match, you got to do it in practice a, a lot. And uh, if you never do it in practice, you're sure as hell not going to do it in a match. So I've just been kind of overemphasizing shooting, and hasn't really shown yet, but um, it's coming. Guys, John said in the wrestling room, one of the big separators for why he went with Jordan was was his grit in the wrestling room this week. What did you guys see out of him in, uh, just during the week in practice? Uh, I think just his attitude. Um, you know, he just he had to sit the last duel, and I think uh, he showed up with a different kind of attitude towards the week, and he, you know, got ready, and he came out and showed, you know, his potential. I think it's going to continue to progress. I think, um, you know, he was excited to get out there, and he had something to prove. Um, you know, him and Sammy both are great, great teammates, and they want what's best for each other. But uh, you know, competition brings out the best in everybody, and uh, I think it's really pushing both of them. I don't know if you, you guys got to watch his match or not, but his energy it seemed pretty infectious to the to the building. Is that how it is in the room with you guys? Uh, yeah. I mean, he he usually brings pretty good energy in the room. Uh, he works hard, so I think this week has really shown like you know this is you know he's he's ready to start wrestling better and getting out there and I don't know just his mindset I think has changed for sure so yeah Connor you mentioned uh you mentioned you might have not won this match last year what, what's different about this Connor just said um I think it's just experience and you know um I've been here before and I think you know I'm just trying to mature and uh I kind of I just want to set an example for my teammates so we had some guys graduate this year and uh, I just kind of want to be a leader for my team. So you can't be losing every close match and having guys look up to you. So I'm just trying to do the best I can for my teammates. From y'all's perspective, what did you think of uh, Dustin's match with Parker Kekai? Oh, well, you know, I think uh, I think Dustin's going to figure it out. Um, he's, a, I mean, he's a gritty guy. He's going to keep pushing forward. And I think I think he's learned he learned a lot from that match. Um, so I'm sure I'm not too worried about him. I think he'll he'll be the guy at the end of the year. So I'm not worried about that. Yeah, I, th I thought his energy level was good. He pushed the pace. Um, saw a lot of good things, and uh, you know, might not have went his way tonight, but like Spratly said, he learns from stuff like that, and he's lost matches before to guys, and really made some good adjustments. So I don't, I'm not too worried about Dustin at all. Troy, I'm Rowdy from Floor Wrestling. Nice to meet you, sir. Um, Question for you is uh, 125. I'm sure. I mean, it's your weight class, so I'm sure you've seen that it's, it's been a crazy year for, for 125, and it's looking like it can be anybody's year to not only be an All American but to be on the national champion. So, kind of, how is that? How is your mentality as the season has gone on and seeing like, wow, this is really anyone's weight? How has that kind of changed or or it changed at all? If if even. Uh, I don't know. Like I said, I talked with coach about this and he uh you know he said you got to live in the moment you can't look you know in the past of what you what happened and you can't look in the future because you know it builds up a lot of anxiety and stuff like that and just it is an open weight class and I believe I will be the guy at the end of the year so that's about it there you go coach